Hello and welcome to Chili Bee Gaming. I'm Evie and today we're back with some more Starfield. And last time we finished up Sam's questline and saved his ex-wife Lillian from the Sioka Syndicate. And um, came back to Akila and basically told him, yeah, you're a good friend. That's about it. There you go. So that's done. So let's get into it. Right, Sam. What's that? Speak to Justin Sneed. Well, do you know what? We'll speak to Justin Sneed then. But then we're going to take you back to um, Constellation and pick up my good lady, my beautiful Andreja. Oh, I've missed her so. Such a wonderful woman. Oh, dear me. Okay, so who's this dude that we've, we've got to speak to? Somebody Sneed. Sneed? Who are you, Sneed? Are you in? You in there? In the in the the guard tower? What? Is this, can we go up this way? Hello? No. Um. Well, Sam, don't mind me, mate. Hello, hop. Mr. Sneed, are you... Tower's oh, closed. geez Louise. Come back some other time. You scared the life out of me, man. Um. I was told to check in with you. I'm Evie, the one who helped out the Elios retreat. <laughs> oh, you're expecting me. The saviour of the Elios retreat has arrived. Yeah. There you go. Hmm. You're them, huh? Mm hmm I've got two rules for this little meeting. Oh, God, go on. Rule number one. You're not to share anything you discuss up there. This is a private matter. No. And we're going to keep it that way. Rule two. You decide to get playful with that weapon. We're going to have serious problems. Think you can abide by those? Ah. Uh. Let's just say sure and see how things go. Suppose I can take that as a yes. Fine, head upstairs. This Lance is waiting for you. Hmm. Well, Justin Sneed, why don't you just get out of here? Thank you. And that must make you our guest. Jeez, that looks like Sarah, but older. Doesn't it? Seriously, though, look. It's like Sarah's aged. Oh my god. Okay. I mean, it doesn't matter. Hey, we all get old. Jeez Louise, I'm old as dirt. So, alright. I'll take a seat. Take a pew. Oh. Now you're just going to stand there, are you? Looking menacing. Really? You look about as menacing as a cuddly toy. Alright. Now, you may already know who I am. Right, Lance. CEO Laredo Firearms. Alright. And you, I know all about. I can't thank you enough for everything you've done for the retreat. It's all right. Truly, it's a project that's near and dear to my heart. Um, you're quite welcome. Now, I presume Nevin already got you up to speed. I need details before I talk to the heads of the Trackers Alliance. Make sure their members understand the retreat's off limits. So if you don't mind, I'd like to just jump right into it. All right. Lily here will be taking notes as we go. Okay. Now, Nevin said all the various incidents afflicting the retreat, they all stemmed from this pair of rogue bounty hunters. Do I have that right? Well... Yeah. Yeah, what sort of other incidents are you talking about? There were a streak of thefts and accidents leading up to Mr. Kilman's kidnapping. Oh. We presumed they were just bad luck or local fauna. Excel's not exactly the most hospitable of worlds, but Nevin made it sound as if those bounty hunters might have been responsible for it all. And I was hoping you could confirm if that was the case or not. Well, all I can confirm is that they were involved in the kidnapping. The rest I wasn't present for, and that's very true. I wasn't. Ah, I'll be sure that's noted. Okay. But you did manage to get those two to leave the retreat alone. Yeah. You mind my asking how you accomplished that? Um, hmm. I just talked with them, yeah. Got them to see reason. Two trackers and you just talked them down? Yeah. That's quite the feat. I'm interested in the details, though. How exactly did it all play out? My god, woman. Uh. Uh. I'm an expert negotiator. Those two are lucky I didn't talk them into flying themselves into a star. 
There you go. I bet they are. So, only other thing I wanted to ask, and I'm just looking for an opinion here. Is there anything in your eyes that could have been done to prevent this happening? Um... Yeah, maybe you need to beef up your security a bit. There wasn't much security there. The retreat's woefully underprotected. You need more security. After everything I've heard from you and Nevin, I'm inclined to agree. There you go. It'll take time to get the right people in place for this kind of work. But I'll make sure it's addressed. Good. But that should give me enough to present to the Alliance. Thank you for making the time. Oh, no problem. Now, what you did, well, it deserves something more than just a couple of firm thank yous. All right. Here. I want you to have these. They're a rare make, but I think you've earned it. What is it? Now, was there anything else you okay. wanted to talk about before we went our What's separate ways? Pe okay, we'll have a look at those. We'll have a look at those after. Um... Hmm. How are you going to get the Trackers Alliance to play ball? Yeah. You make lots of friends in my position. Oh. Friends in the Free Star Collective. Friends in the UC. The sort of people with influence over things. Like, say, how much a locality is allowed to spend on Alliance contracts each quarter. Uh... When the Alliance heads grasp that it's better for us all to be friends, I expect they'll leave the retreat well enough alone. I see. So, it all comes down to money. Of course it does. Well, do you know what? I think you're doing a real good job with the retreat. Yeah, it's, it's a good thing to do, I think. That's kind of you. But without your help, it might have stayed just a goal. Well, there you go. You have my sincere thanks. Now, if you'll excuse me, as you've seen, there's plenty to be done. Uh-huh. You keep everything on the level and we'll get along great. You need to shut up. God. Very irritating, man. Oh, what's that? Oh, I don't want that. Check in with the Elios Retreat staff. Oh, we've got to go back again. Well, Sam, let's um, let's uh, wander on out of okay. here. Hello, Lily. Don't really know you that well, but that's fine. Okay, let's wander on down. You have a nice day now. Oh, I will. Don't you worry. I wonder if there's any uh, any other things that we can be doing here in Aquila. Aquila. Oh, we want to have a look at the, the new stuff, don't we? Um, weapons. So, I need to sell these. Hmm. What did they give us? Did they give us a peacemate? No, they didn't. Space suits. Liquid cooled advanced peacemaker suit. Uh, I mean, it's a ledge, Joe. It's got less mass than what we've got on at the moment. But, ah, hmm, don't know if it looks that cool. Eh. That does not. Okay. Anything else here? Oh, God, the hat. I forgot about the hat. Never mind. I think they gave us some bullets and stuff, didn't they, as well? I don't know whether they... Did they give us that peacemaker? They might have done. I can't remember. Maybe we could try out the peacemaker. It looks like kind of a cool thing. 25% increase... In attack speed. Ah. Alright. Uh, where should we put it? What don't we use that much? We don't really use... Uh, we don't really use that breach much, do we? It's a bit slow. That's the only problem with it. Okay. Well, alright. Right. right um, oh, we were going to look at what we can do here. Top Sarah Morgan. Marco Jensen, a guard manager of the Jensen family, has fallen on hard times since they immigrated to Aquila City. Oh, okay. Well, do you know what? We'll do some. We'll do some charitable acts. Why not? Kind of offset, you know, some of our previous misdemeanors. I don't know. All right. Well, hello. Dad keeps saying he's sorry all the time. It's weird. Why are you squat? No, sitting in mud. I Sit in the house. Real chance, but there's too little opportunity, and it's hard to compete with native free star folk. Thank God. I, I thought, I thought the Shaw gang was going to kill all the hostages in the bank. Well, don't worry. You were amazing. Thank you. No problem. Um. Yeah, I'm just glad everyone made it out alive. Yeah. We wouldn't have made it without you. Okay. Listen, I, I have nothing. 
Less than nothing. Well, I don't want anything. My family moved here from Sidonia. Okay. Hoping for a better life. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I just feel cursed. And I... I could live with that if it was just me. But Simone? And little Liv? <laughs> Alright, dude. Easy now. It's okay. Um... I'm sorry to hear your family's got it so rough, yeah? It's all right. So many people here look past my family being UC and are just like that. Kind. A real sense of community. I just need a job and we could be happy here. Sorry, I. Uh, you should feel good. Super good about what you did at Galbank. You want to talk about anything? Well, I think you want to talk about something, dude. Do you not? A man should provide for his family. Not drag them down along with him. I've got to do better. Well, I'd like to help you. We've been given as much charity as I can stomach. Without the low house... I mean, there's something. But it's a hell of a thing to ask. Oh, nothing's too much to ask. Um, yeah. I really mean it. I want to help you, Lee. As dark as things are, there are so many good people out there. Uh-huh. Simone, my wife, has got a cousin. Milena Exelrod. Truthfully, I never much cared for Milena. But she runs freight, and I know her routes sometimes take her this way. Milena is family. Might be she'd do something for her kin. I'm looking for a job, and I'll do anything. Well, anything legal. Okay. Milena's United Colonies, like us, and I know she's got problems of her own with Aquila City. Um... Yeah? Yeah, what's the problem with Aquila City, first uh, of all? She clams up the times I've asked. Not oh, even dear. Simone knows. Hmm. I'm sure she's run afoul of the law somehow. That's kind of how she operates. Well, I got a ship. Shouldn't be a problem to talk to her. <sighs> you are Milena. an answer to our prayers. All right. Milena called Simone yesterday. I'm pretty sure she's still in the system. Just giving me any hope. It's a lot. Well, do you know what? I'll sort it out, man. Get back in your house. It's bloody horrible rain out here. Right. Uh, do you know what? We could maybe do... Maybe do with something. Um, uh, uh, what What? What happened here? This is, this is not exactly how a bar should be, is it? Do you know what? We'll eat on the ship. I, I, I don't want to... Yeah. Alright, let's go. Hello! We got pirates all over the damn board. Here to join the good times of crap! Fine, fine, okay. I'm going. Okay, I don't know why the why the kids give me help. Is this the... Okay, it's the, the dalliance is... Okay. Okay, I don't I don't want to... I don't want to target her. My God, I want to hail. Hello? Hello, stranger! Oh, jeez. Uh, oh, God. We got pirates all over the damn board. Here to join the good times express. Sorry, I didn't catch that the first time. Um, there might be a little bit of a problem because can we just hail them and tell them? Oh, this has caused a bit of a problem because I um, well, might need to hit the key soon for a resupply. This has caused me a real problem. The fleet looks after its own, mostly. Because they won't attack me, but they will attack her. Hmm. Madam? Hello? Um. Yeah, I just don't really want to murder the pirates because. Uh, can y'all not just go away? Alright. There you go. Had to. Had to do it. Had to do it. I'll pay it off. It's fine. All right. I didn't want to do this, you know. It's not my aim, but well. All right. Oh, this is this is awful. Fifteen thousand creds, man. Really? Oh, plastic. Mm. Yeah, this is this is not ideal. Ha. Huh. Yeah.
All right. Thanks for the assist. You're welcome to board. Uh oh. Now I got a bounty that I have to pay off. It's kind of poop. Well, all right. All right. Damn, they're gonna be mad. Oh, sorry, just having a, a sip of my my right, hot dropping. chocolate. Whoa! Well, oh. All right, Milena Axelrod. Oh, if fighting the fleet doesn't get the juices flowing, you're doing it wrong. A little bit it's like a bridge almost. It's supposed to be safe around here, but Cheyenne has always been just a giant bastard to me. Oh, <clears throat> unless you're a native. In which case, oh my god, I love what you've done with the place. Yeah, yeah. Um, hmm. Yeah, how did she Cheyenne get on your bad side? I swear, every time I come through here, something goes to shit. But it always calls me back. Take now. I'm just supposed to be doing some deliveries and whammo! Pirates! Cheyenne's going to get me one of these days. Okay, uh, Marco Jensen sent me. His family's in dire financial straits and need your help. Ha! I knew it! I knew I it! I like the outfit. Damon should have told me. Her and Marco are so damned proud. I'd love to help them out. Might be I've got a... <laughs> Checker history with the fine city of Aquila. Okay. If you clear up any lingering hard feelings, then I could resume doing business there. I'd set up Stick Up As Marco as my official importer. Yeah. Then wins all around. How did you get blacklisted? Yeah. I used to do cargo hauls for the mayor, and he got really upset that I might have been carrying more than I ought to. We had some words, maybe one fat lip, not mine. Oh. And now I'm persona non grata. I see. So you, you kicked off with the mayor and punched him in the mouth. Lovely. Tell me how to clear this up. Two paths, I see. The trade authorities got a fixer named Tom Starrett. He might be able to facilitate things. Mm -hmm. Or Mayor Cartwright. Ah. Got that windbag. Well, <laughs> if he'd take a sorry, that would work. Fat chance. Either way, I expect credits will be on the line. On the back end, I could afford to give you a taste of the action. Not sure it'll cover the fees. Hmm. Well, do you know what? <sighs> I might try talking with the mayor. Because I have done him a favour. You're brave. Yeah. I mean, obviously, with all the yoo out there. Marco doesn't deserve you. But Simone, she's one of the good ones. You square things away. Just let Marco know. All right, all right. Um, just, just, just wondering, curiosity and all that jazz. Uh, ooh, them. What's in here? Oh. Well, I've got to cover my feet, have I not? <laughs> what? Captain's locker's empty. God bless it. Well, never mind. Um, you got any? You got any grub in here? I could do with a snack. I did come a long way, and I did kill the pirates, which I probably shouldn't have done because I'm going to get in trouble. But, well, I suppose once I pay them, they'll be happy. Oh, all right. Well, um, th th thank you for your um, time. Okay, brilliant. So we need to talk to the mayor, which is fine. One thing I do just want to check. Can we... All right. Well, let's get in here. Is this so? Hmm. Which one's the mayor, though? Where's the mayor? That's obviously the trade authority over there, I think. Because they're behind Galbank. Is it? Okay. Hmm. So, who are you, sir? Who are you? Mm. Here. Oh yes, there you go. There's the mayor. Hey, dude. Um, What's just boost. Gross. Really gross. Whatever, kid. Um, do you suppose we will need some um, some assistance? Shall we say in our in our means of 
Persuasion. Aquila City truly is the jewel of the Free Star Collective. Uh-huh. We talk. The finest folk in the settled systems make their home right here. I want to get my Melina Axelrod permission to do business in Aquila City. Melina Axelrod? Yep, Melina. I sorry. wished I'd never heard that name again. She's a menace. She punched me in the face. Can you imagine? Yes. Why would you want to let her back here? Uh, I want to help her her family, the Jans Jensens. Might escape starving to death. Is she really that bad? Yes. Maybe. Uh, I don't know. Mm -mm. I mean, she ran cargo for me for years. I even considered her a friend. But she stabbed me in the back. Well, not literally. But I swore to keep her banned for life. Well, that's silly. If we help her, her family, the Jansons, might escape starving to death. Yes. What? Oh, that, that's terrible. Uh-huh. Listen, I feel for the uh, Jansons. If it was just the fisticuffs, I could look the other way. Oh, God. But we caught her smuggling red-handed. She's been blacklisted for good reason. But legally, if you pay off her bounty, I can't stop her from coming back. But we'll be watching her. <sighs> Should we try and persuade him? We could use our Free Star Ranger clout. Uh, yes, sod it. I'm a ranger and I'll vouch for her. You'd go that far for her? Yep. Fine. Fine. She can come back. Good. I just hope you don't regret it. Nope. I did, last time I trusted her. Alright, well, uh, thank you, Mr. Mayor. You carry on. Observing the city as as is your want to do, sir. Brilliant. Well, there you go. Didn't even cost us a dime. How good's that, eh? Just too bloody marvellous, I tell you what. Hello. Please don't bring up Milena to Simone. The whole thing is a long shot. Well, good news. Milena contacted me. She's making me her official importer. I'm not sure how much it pays, but I'll take it. You have no idea what you've done. Mm, just be careful. She'd been caught smuggling before. I better tell him, not just. I figured it might be something like that. Yeah. I'll make sure to keep my distance from any of that. Good. I can't wait to tell Simone. This is the first ray of sunshine we've seen in years. Cool. Well, hopefully that eleven thousand five five hundred will um, pay off my bounty with the Crimson Fleet. Why were you just whistling down my ear all? That's very rude, you know. Bloody guards. All right. Oh. Madness. Hmm. See, we could return to the uh, the lodge, drop off Sam, pick up Andreja, and um, talk to Vladimir on our way out. Yes, that might be that might be the way forward. Hmm. Okay. Well, let's go. Come on, Sam. We're getting out of here, baby. And we have arrived upon the scene. Well, Samuel, here's the thing, mate. It's been totally emotional, but it's time for you and your kid to stay here. Make it quick. Oh, actually, you've got someone to say stuff. no to a gift. All right. Well, I think it's time we went our separate ways. We may need to reevaluate this partnership someday. And there you go. But I like being able to come home to my room too. Well, off you go, kid. Because I am here for my I good lady. I appreciate you asking. Hmm? Oh, sorry. Right. I'll be sure and have an extra coffee, in my just in case. Trade the gabs with you. Andreja. And just what is on your mind at this moment? Oh, it's wonderful to see you, my dear. Um, are you ready to head back out? I'm at your side. Brilliant. Ah. Ah. It's so good to have you back, my dear. Would you like I to carry some stuff for me? I always enjoy this moment. If there's anything you need, I am happy to share. In fact... 
We it won't. It is always a pleasure. Have Andreja carry it. We will drop it off in our room upstairs shortly. Um, Vladimir. Ah, it will be a shame to pack up all the modifications to the eye for finding the artifacts. But she's earned a break. Gilded our fortunes for sure. Uh-huh. Um... Hmm. Yeah, we we could say the same for you. you we couldn't have done it without you. Uh-huh. I'm just an old blade in the dark trying to make good. I'll be taking up the chair when everyone's gone in the Unity. Set Constellation's course for another new beginning. Not my first time at the helm for a crew, but going to take it slow. Um. <laughs> That's a good, uh, a good answer. Um. Yeah, we would rather you come with us into the Unity, but I suppose it's, yeah, Constellation will be in good hands with you, yeah, it will. Uh, don't know about that. Intend to keep teaching folks how to play the Troublemaker's game. Uh. No use being an explorer if you aren't a little dangerous. True. Well, tipped your ear long enough. I'll be smiling as you walk through Eternity's Gate. Give the next universe something to talk about, yeah? All right. Can I not talk to you about, um... Hmm? Oh, sorry. Uh... Was doing the tallies work in my head. Inventory on the station. Next supply run. Your artifact search must be a full-time job. That's why I missed your little welcome party. Got caught up plotting all the data the eye can give us. Okay. Wouldn't mind the helper's hand, though. Could speed the process along. Okay. Up-to-date planetary scans would help filter all the data I have to sift through. Maybe help to find the anomalous bits. All right. And Constellation can slide a credit or two your way. All part of the mission of charting the stars, right? Well, survey data? Yeah, I can get that for you. Then we're hand in hand in agreement. Now, get out there and burn some helium. I see. So you... you oh, I've got some survey data Let's for you, apparently. Deal. Wow, I really do have survey data, do I? Oh no, sorry. Oh yeah. Okay. There you go. I don't think I have any in the ship's inventory, do I? What's, what's this? Oh, I do! Hey! I got two lots of survey data there. Okay. Uh... Okay, well, well, well. Show right. the words oh. another time then. Yeah, but still saying I can talk to him about Never it. Never so. regretted coming out of retirement. Uh, Constellation's got the writ of the righteous. Keeps me young. Oh, I was hoping you could point me to another artifact temple. Found one. Easy as a needle in this stack. Hope those powers you're getting to overinflate you. Got enough eagles in Constellation. All right. Acquire the power on Barra 7D. Brilliant. Right. Hello. We'll uh, wander up to our room, drop off some stuff. And then maybe head out. Didn't Vladimir have like a, a a house or something? Am I tripping out on that? Let's have a look. It would probably be in miscellaneous, do you suppose? Or activity. Hmm. Uh, I still want to visit these on Earth as well. Should we go and visit Earth? That might be quite nice. Uh, hmm. Visit Vladimir's house. Can we... Can we see where that is? Maybe. Alright. Well, what we'll do, while we're, while we're kind of... still here, in the kind of... in the system, I'd like to visit these. I know it's not exactly a big mission, but you know what? It's Earth, baby. It's our home. And although it's a little bit of a shambles in Starfield, it's still our home, you know. I hate to think of it so damaged and, you know, busted up. All right, I'm going to drop off this stuff. Hold on. It looks very much like the, the London one. This is the Osaka landmark. Andre, just sorry, my dear. Uh, ship's landing site. Okay. Um. 
Damn! Poor old Earth, eh? Absolutely stunning. What's the... Ah! This is the Osaka landmark and... Oh, a little snow globe. Okay, let's... let's. Should we have a look? Can we see this little thing? How do we get that? Never mind. Don't ask. Don't ask. Um, Osaka snow globe. Oh, hey. Look at this. Does the snow fall in it? No, it doesn't. Damn. Well, that's 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 pretty, in a in a in a way. All right. Well, we'll we'll should we go and visit the Dubai one as well, just to, you know, collect the whole set kind of deal. Okay, I'm sensing a theme here, um, Bethesda. They all seem to be. skyscrapers with holes in. I don't think we can go inside them, can we? I think we tried this last time. I mean, although there is a slightly different variant, I understand that much. Um, okay, can we, can we, hello? So what is it, another, um, another snow globe thing? Yeah. Visit Vladimir's house. Well, okay, let's just have a little peep at this, this, uh, Dubai snow globe. Okay. All right. Well, I mean, it's 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 pretty. Again, like I say, um, Oh, hey, who's this? Who are you? 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 All we need is enough to do some field repairs to just get back to home dock. I had a good feeling about you. We just need a little. Two units of ship parts will do. All right, you can take it. That's fine. Oh, I don't have enough. Oh, damn. Oh, no. What are we going to do now? Well, I don't know, dude. I thought I had enough spare parts. What? What? I mean, what? Bloody hell. Did we... Are you... Are we... What the hell? Well, do you know what? Do you know what? what? What can I do? Vlad's Villa. Love it. Let's scan the place. Lots of water, nickel, temperate climate. Yeah, let's 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 land, baby. It's lovely to see you, Vasco. So this is Vladimir's house. Jagged heart leaf. Okay. What does your scanner reveal? It says that there's a jagged heart leaf here, Andreja. That's what it says. My dear, unknown life signs. So, okay. I mean, what's it made of? It looks like it's, I don't know, made of stone archways are nice. Okay, so what's, 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 what's in here? This is kind of fancy, girl. Fire pit. Can't light it though. What's this? Barbecue. Nice little bar there. Somewhere to sit and huff some uh, shisha, if that's what you want. Is it shisha or hookah? I can never remember. What's this? Vladimir Sal, slate one. The first gotten run I ever pulled was a large cargo freighter. Hauling kitchen and cupboard. 
Is that pond or a pool? It's just a pond. Fine test for a rook back then. Nothing like feeling the key's belly to earn nods from the old knives. Went knuckle to bone with the freighter's crew straight away. Thought I was just eager to show myself off. Make sure my crew knew I was dangerous, even unarmed. Looking back, think I just wanted to know that I was taking the prize fair one's way. Give them a chance to fight for it. But even telling yourself you're winning it from someone is a break on a dark road. Every take was a smile on my face, knowing that I was I better, would not wish to make too stronger, many assumptions about where the credits for all this came from. But it seems that Brian does indeed hurt. When indeed you know the UC is mm -hmm. always hunting you. This is, uh, this is nice. Wow, that is nice. So this is like Vladimir's house. Can we stay here, do you suppose? Would he let us stay here? I think he would, wouldn't he? This is nice. Such a fancy man. I wonder why he doesn't stay here more often. Well, I, mean, I suppose it is a little bit out of the way, isn't it? It's quite quite a distance from... Um... Never mind. From... Um... Constellation, but, well... Oh, hey, dude! Little robot man. Okay, so I'm going here. I know this is our friend's house and we're here just robbing him blind, but, well, we're not. Would you... Oh, sorry. Well, do you know what? He wouldn't mind. He wouldn't mind. We've 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 put in the hours. Okay. Anything else? Oh. Oh. Okay. This is worth the effort. Gentle reminder, folks. If you ever let me stay in your house, be warned. <laughs> no, I wouldn't obviously do any of this in real life. I wouldn't go sniffing around in somebody's private um, private room. I'm gonna pinch that turkey though. Nothing is beyond our reach. T W S S. When we work together. Oh, well, okay. Ah, yeah. Perhaps Med all this does come at a cost. Advanced to bail. one's peace of mind, if nothing else. Yeah. I'm sure Vladimir wouldn't mind. He doesn't use it anyway. Hey, <laughs> hey. All right. There you go. Plus, we're the ones out there fighting the good fight. You know? Food, full food spice worms. We will, oops, eat them. Okay. What's he doing here? This. Okay. Ah, oh, look at that. It's got a bushy galacticat. Lovely. Dracula. I've still not started that read along thing, have I? I must do it at some point. The mutineer. Ooh. Ooh, Vladimir, I'm sorry, my friend, but I'm taking that. Okay, we'll we'll leave the helmet. Oh, Andreja, you made yourself right a right bloody helmet there, didn't you? All right. So what's upstairs then? Okay. Wow, look at all these little things. Cool. All right. Uh, anything else here? Tablets. Quick boil coffee brewer. I'd love a brew. What do you reckon, Andreja? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Oh, this is nice. This is lovely. Oh. Vladimir got it right. Slate 4. Well, where's slate 2 and 3, then? Maybe in the kitchen? We'll have a look in the kitchen. Oh. Why would you have a kitchen... Never mind, don't ask. Alright. Uh, yep. Instigating Assassin's Advanced Urban Eagle. It's rare. Yep. So that's Slate 3. Where is Slate 2 then? I mean, yeah, this is, this is, this is nice. Very nice. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat that bread. And these, 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 yep. Sorry, Andre, I'm, I'm very, very hungry. And I need some food, baby. Okay. What have we got here? Ooh, Sydney ham. Veal kits. Can't eat the blender. Veal and steak. Oh, what am I doing? Okay. Huh. 
where's the second slate? Is it in here, do you reckon? Oh, this is the bedroom. Nice! This is nice! I like it. I thought he had sushi next to his bed then. I was going to say, that is a that is a random thing to find. He does have a, um, a target behind the bed head, though. That's a little bit weird. And choco cubes. Take them. That's slate five. Well, 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 well. Isn't this just lovely, Andreja? My God. Well, this is very nice, my dear, is it not? And we are going to leave it there for today. Next time we uh, we might wander off and find another power or two. See what we can find. So until next time, be safe, be good, and look after yourselves.